What's going on guys? Welcome back to a new video. Today we have kind of like a card show video mixed with a mail day video or a mail day format. Got also a big surprise with that that I'm really excited to show you guys. I think you guys are really going to enjoy this one. And uh, yeah, you guys like these kind of videos. We'll have a lot of card show live at the card show videos coming soon. But you guys like these, make sure you like the video and subscribe. Helps us do a lot more like it and you can sign up for membership as well and get some bonus content. Links below and helps us do more stuff like this. But went to a card show uh, really close to me actually and decided to make the drive out there and uh, heard about it right before the event, not too long before it. I was like, why not go out there? You know, see what's going on. I've been to like the national. I've been to some of the bigger ones, but this isn't necessarily like a super small show, but it was a smaller one. And uh, so it's like, why not go out there and see what's going on? So went out there. I wanted to record a video there. I brought my stuff with me. Ultimately decided not to. It was a smaller area, a little more crowded. I didn't want to get in people's way. And you know, sometimes just walking around with a camera can be kind of just like a, a pain for both both people involved. Everyone at the show, as well as myself. So I decided, let me just. You know, do what I want to do. If I find something to buy, I'll do it. And I did in this case some pretty cool stuff. Um, but yeah, so didn't do a video live out there. Usually I do, as you've seen in the past, try to get a video of me doing all the deals. But in this situation, I didn't think it was the best time to do it. So we'll do it in the future, of course. Nationals coming up very soon, so we'll have plenty of those. But here's what we got. So let's get into these singles here. So just kind of went there and just thought that, hey, whatever I find that I might like, I'll get. If it's nothing, it's nothing. But if I find something cool, why not? So I was looking through the dollar boxes to the showcases. One thing I was looking for was a Trey Lance contenders autograph, either maybe like the championship ticket, maybe the ice. I don't know. Um, definitely was a long shot and I didn't find one, unfortunately. But here is what I was able to get. So here we go. Start with this here. I'll tell you how much I uh, paid for these. And let me know. I'll start from one to 10 after. How do you think I did? So make sure of some basketball and some football here. So here we go. And um, yeah, so here's the first kind of lot. I'll, I'll just go one by one. So got a Gary Trent Jr. rookie. I like Gary Trent Jr. And um, it's kind of cool that he was one guy who we dreaded pulling and now he's he's a good player. So yeah, it's uh, cool to see that. It was in the dollar box. I was like, why not? You know, why not get Gary Trent Jr. for a dollar? And for 50 cents more, you can get the Prism one. So there we go. Now this is part of a kind of bulk lot here. So I'll show you everything in where everything fell in a second, but um, yeah, got this one as well. Um, Brandon Boston Jr., Orange Don Russ. I like him, think he's a good player, so dollar for that. Why not, right? Why not? So there we go. And not numbered or anything like that, but it's the orange laser from the retail ones. Then another Gary Trent Jr. This one's five bucks. And once again, I worked into a deal, so a little bit less. And um, here we go. So the Ruby Red Wave, my favorite parallel. You guys know me. I can't resist some non-numbered reds all day. So there we are, and uh, got Jordan Love. This was actually a throw into the deal at the very last minute, and I'll show you what the centerpiece of the deal was in a second. So Jordan Love, QB season. So we'll see. What is he going to do? Is he going to be really good, really bad? Who knows? We're not going to know for probably a long time, but QBs, it's always a lot of fun. And uh, yeah, see QBs there, here in the background. Actually, we have Zach Wilson in the back today. Got that dog in him and had to show love today. So uh, yeah, packing cards IG as well. Check it out. Drop a follow if you're interested. It's free and everything like that. Links below as well as Discord and TikTok. But yeah, it's always fun to try to see who's good, who's going to be not so good. Jordan Love, I'm really not sure, but I'll take a flyer for a few bucks and why not, right? What do you guys think? Might be a little bit before we see him, but yeah, there we go. So Prism Rookie of Jordan Love. Then this is the one that actually started everything because I saw this first and this is the one I wanted the most. Kenny Galladay. Of course, he's a giant now and uh, it was a dollar. To 149, it's 006. So there we go. And uh, why not? For a dollar, I'll take it, of course. So I was happy to get this one. And I saw this first, and that's when I started going through the rest of the boxes and pulling some other stuff. So, and as always, everyone who made a deal with me, appreciate you guys. Thank you very, very much. So, got this one. This is probably one of my more favorite ones. For a dollar, you know, can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. Even if he was like the worst player on earth, it's a dollar. So, I like this one. I love this color purple. So that drew me to it immediately. And uh, initially this sticker, it was actually, I took it out of the top loader. It was on this side. So it's covered by the sticker, the rookie logo. So I didn't know it was a rookie hundred percent. I was like, it looks like one, but I don't see the logo. So then I saw it was, and I was like, all right, I'll take it for a dollar. Then actually let's uh, get to these first. The centerpiece card is actually this one. I put it out of order. That's my bad. But we have this one. As we were leaving the show, I saw this and uh, they had a $5 box and he's like, hey, everything in this box is $3 since I'm starting to move some stuff at the end of the show. And I said, say no more. I found this one for three bucks it was, right? So um, yeah, 
why not? Like once again, taking a flyer for a few bucks. Uh, this one here, I think we did pretty well. If I give it a scan using my center stage app, which is free, and I'll link it down below, then uh, I think we did not too bad. So that's a BGS95, but um, going to some. 2022 ones like there you go like six bucks on the 28th so yeah i'll take it and there's some older ones as well but this would be probably a pretty good one there like six bucks i'll take it why not right so yeah that's my uh other one and then continue on we got this for miss pack the classics tray rookie it's a nice one i like it so she liked this one a lot has a little fun fact on the back and she's like i want this one a lot so got it for her there we are, and um, yeah, did you know that he likes Steve Nash? All right, pretty cool, so there we are. Then I got this one, so here we go. 72 to 75, I love me some cracked dice. This is part of a package with this card right here, and had to get it, so that's, uh, once again, the 75, the 75th anniversary one, and cracked dice just always looks so good. And um, this one, I think, was, well, here, I'll tell you the price was with this one, too. Um, so this one first, it is a little dinged in the corner, so that was factored in a bit, but here's the other one uh, with that. It is this one, Scotty Barnes, Cracked Dice, 21 to 25. I like this one a lot. Also, it has a little surface issue right there in the back, so these both had a little bit of condition stuff. Um, got both of these for 100, and yeah, I thought that was a nice one. Double ice action, and uh, this is a 25, this is a 75. Scotty, yeah, this is the player of the day ones, we opened those... Uh, those packs and they're fun so there we go and then this is photogenic can't go wrong with that one so what do you think about these two 100 bucks corner issue there and then a little surface issue but still nice cards it's all you can go with really can't go wrong with something nice and then here is the uh the big one that was part of the package with these ones and once again my bad for putting it out of order so these with this one now with this card here here we go this one here Polarizing player, some people are going to love it, some people are going to absolutely hate it. This is a card channel, so I'm thinking from a card perspective, it's a really sick card. I thought it was uh, for a fair price, so I decided to pick it up. And um, yeah, here's the one I got here. So this was with these, and here we go. So this is a very unique card, and when I saw it, it immediately caught my eye. So there's a few things about this card I wanted to point out. First of all, it's a one of one. Second of all, Nike Swoosh. Third of all, it's game worn. And I was just like, wow, that's a beautiful, beautiful one. So this all together was a hundred and couldn't turn that down. So you know, once again, some people might love it. Some people might hate it from a card perspective. It is not a cool card. Game more Nike Swish, one of one and uh, shows all the information about this. I wish it did it more because this is the game that was worn, everything like that. So you can read that little blurb on the back, but I love stuff like this. You guys know I'm a sucker for kind of game worn, especially now and uh, love Nike Swish. So Wish it was like the more whole part of the Swish, but still, one of one can't go wrong with that. So, what do you guys think about this one? 100, one of one, got some uh, dollar box stuff here, and just going around seeing if I saw anything um, that I thought was cool or nice, and um, this is like PC. These guys are not really PC at all, but I just thought it was cool. I was like, hey, decent deal, cool stuff, I'll go for it, why not? And that's what we got. So, yeah, what do you think about this card? Game worn, they let you know when it was, where it was, how he did, and yeah i just i love this card it's so cool just the game worn aspect and linking it to something specific which is awesome i think baseball does that with like the stickers and they don't do that at all sometimes they're like player worn sometimes game worn but you don't know when so knowing when is just awesome so there we go got this one it's a one of one and then someone's very nice and uh gave me these ones so got some easton stick and uh, a ja Morant hga this might be my first hga slab i think is it it's not first second but i don't have very many of these but there we go well, it went, so thank you to them and everyone else. And then uh, here's our final one here, our big surprise. And boy, oh boy, is it a really cool item, man. This is um, truly a surprise to myself as well. So someone let me know that they were sending a package and they have a little card in here, so I'll show that in a second. And big thanks to them. I'll name them just very shortly. So came in here, and got to be careful not to knock off Zach, but... Even if I bumped it, I don't think he's going anywhere. All right, so here's what we got. <laughs> Look at that. Let me uh, get this actually out, out of the box. So let me get it to focus first. Look at that. You know who that is? My guy. And I want to be very careful getting this out here. 
There we go. So let's take a look at what we have here. Woo hoo hoo! All right. Yeah, this giant box is uh, gonna have to take a scooch just in a second. Sorry, box. Appreciate you, but it's time to go. And there he goes. Adios. All right. So here's what we got. And uh, yeah, it's just really cool. So, oh, here's the card actually. So, Shep's cards, big shout out and thanks to them. They actually had Bane in their shop. And I was heartbroken I couldn't go, but there you go. There's their information. Awesome, dude. Dude, thank you so much. So, Bane was signing and he had him sign out a little picture to me right here. He signed his name, 22, my favorite number. Awesome picture of him shooting. I'm sure he made it. And he wrote to Pac-Man. <laughs> I'm stunned when I saw that. I hit him up. I just, I was like, wait, did he write to, did he write my name? And he's like, yeah. I can't believe it. Desmond Bane wrote Pac-Man. So Desmond Bane, I know you're not watching this, but if you ever watch it, I love you, man. Thank you so much. And thank you to Shep's Cards. That is just so cool. I, I'm I'm stunned. First, the uh, Spurs hook it up. I need to get some frames and some stuff like that because this is so, so, so cool. To get slightly creased, I don't care at all. Got a little smudge scratch there. Don't even care a little bit because, I mean, what's almost cooler than the signature, I think this is cooler than the signature to me. The fact that he wrote Pac-Man on here, I, I was like, me and Miss Pac-Man opened it together, and my jaw just, like, crashed onto the floor. Oh, my goodness. That's just so cool. So, thank you, Desmond Bain. I gotta get some jersey action. I gotta get some signed shoes, signed ball, the whole Bain shrine. But, yeah, it's so cool. And I think they have some more events in the future with him. So, hopefully, I can make it out to those because that is just the coolest thing. One of my favorite players. It's not my favorite player right now. And, yeah, I mean, that's just amazing. To be able to meet him would be a dream come true. So, hopefully... I can uh, make it out to a future event and um, not fanboy, but that's not likely. But yeah, just such a cool piece. So thank you again to, uh, here we go. Shep's car. Oh, it's not focus. Shep's cars. There we go. So shop there in Tennessee. And uh, man, what a piece. Thank you, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks to Desmond. Thank you to uh, Shep's there. And yeah, there we go. So a little, uh, little card show mail day in a way. So not usually how we do things, but um, I thought this would be the most appropriate way to do things, just given everything. So what do you guys think about the pickups? Big dub, big L, medium, read Oscar from one to 10. So I know we got uh, these ones here. Some people might think I did terrible. Some people might think I knocked out the park. We always have varying opinions, but what do you guys think? So here we go. And uh, cool, got some one of one action, some ice action and um, dollar box. I mean, that's a pretty cool find for a dollar PC numbered rookie. So we'll have Phoenix too. That does it, guys. A lot of fun. If you want to see more uh, card show stuff, things like this, make sure you drop a like and subscribe. Let me know. We'll do some more. National coming up. That will be live at the show. So this one, I didn't do it at the show. Um, maybe we can do it in the future. Maybe. I'm not too sure. But in the future, we will have it at the show. So what are your thoughts? And um, let me know how I did. Scale from 1 to 10. So that does it, guys. Thank you as always for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.